Well, hello and welcome to the Intuitive Messenger channel. They call me Mitchell and this is your energy forecast and intuitive message for today, Sunday, July the 9th, 2017. And as always, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So your message today is this. Inside every challenge is the opportunity to change. And that's actually a play on the letters as well, because if you remove the LLE from challenge, you get the word change. So every time we have a challenge, we have an opportunity to change, to grow. So, you know, I was speaking with somebody um, the other day, and they were just talking about a tumultuous relationship they had years ago. And I can usually tell someone's growth and enlightenment and, and, and just overall perspective when they say, I was so mad at the end of that relationship or that event or whatever, but now I look back and see how it was a catalyst for great change in their life, in my life. I've had the same thing. So look at your challenges as opportunity for change. Just think of your muscle. You go into the gym, you grab a heavy weight, you lift it a bunch of time, and what you're actually doing is you're ripping the muscle fibers. You're ripping them. And that's why they're soreness the next day because they're, they're rebuilding stronger for the next time you do that. So, you know, every challenge is the opportunity for you to change, to grow, and to become more of who you are and what you're here to experience, which is the contrast of this world and just everything you possibly can. So, there's your message. Cards, energy, numbers for the next couple of days. So today is an eight day. That means all the numbers add up. So you take seven, nine, 20, 17. You add it up, reduce it down to a single digit. It gives you number nine, which is completions, endings, bringing things to a close, transition. And from Lenormand, 15, which is the bear. The bear can be about mama bear, daddy bear, parental figures and guidance, um, power, strength, protection. Sometimes it can be about your, your diet um, and your resources. From terror to go along with this day, ten of swords. So this could be where you're still inflicting some pain and anguish, you know, on on top of, of all the, the worry and frustration. Or you being mama bear, papa bear is creating a lot of your own worry and frustration because sometimes you're you're stepping in as a parental figure for someone who did not ask it, who does not want it. And by you continuing to support them or be mama, papa, bear to them, you're not allowing them to have their own experience. It's like holding the back of the bike seat because you don't want your child to fall. Gosh, if you hold it on for the rest of their life, they're never going to have the freedom of riding the bike themselves. So sometimes we have to fall and scrub our knees because... That's where our cha change comes in from that challenge we just went through. So tomorrow, all the numbers add up to, I'm sorry, today was an eight day. So I kept saying 999. So maybe whenever I make mistakes, I call them divine intervention. So today could be more of a transitional day for you, but it is an eight day. So let me be clear about that. All the numbers today add up to eight, which is usually victory, success, um, and material wealth and things. So put that back into perspective of the worry, the diet, the resources. Maybe you're still worrying about your success. Now tomorrow is actually a nine day, Monday. Monday the 10th is a nine day transition completions. And from Lenormand, we've got 28, which is the man. So if you're a man, this is about you. If you're not a man, then it's about a man in your life. This could be me in your life. It's definitely me because I'm the man and I'm reading it. And then from Tarot Queen of Coins. So this could be, for me, I would say, okay, this is my Capricorn side needing to come out, bringing things to a close. But look for that man or that, that person in your life that is Queen of Coins energy, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo energy. Great mother, very grounded, very earthy. Could help you bring some things to a close. Could help you understand, could help you get grounded, if you will, for tomorrow. And maybe you're that Queen of Coins. You're looking for, you know, a man or you're bringing a relationship or something to an end. You know, uh, so there's your message there. Then Tuesday, all the numbers do add up to one. <laughs> and that it starts beginning. So after, you know, we, we had this round of, you know, eight success, nine completions, and an hour. One starts in beginnings again. And from Lenormand, it's 30. Lily. Lily is about longevity, purity, you know, maturity. It's, it's you know, great. If you're asking, am I going to stay somewhere a long time? And the lilies comes up, yes. If you're asking, how's the date going to go? It's going to last a long time. It's probably going to be some sex involved because Lily can be about passionate spiritual sex. And then the four of wands can be about marriage, you know, something in the house. You know, if you're asking questions about your house and home, this could mean that there's a lengthy stay or a lengthy process. Um, this could be about, 
you know, a, a, a lengthy marriage that is connecting or meeting someone and a lengthy relationship. Again, it's a one day, so something starting, something beginning on Tuesday that could be a partnership or a marriage, something solid that lasts for a long time, or it could be just real passionate, you know, um, romantic kind of a love as well. So there's your message. Hey, check out my websites if you want to know more about me and what I do. Mitchell Osborne is the intuitive psychic website. Mitchell Osborne hypnotherapy.com is the hypnotherapy. Um, on both of them, you can have links back to um, my events that I do in Central Florida, Sanford, Kissimmee, Orlando, St. Cloud. A lot of things happening there over the next month through August. And uh, the Black Swan is the special of the month about looking into your shadow side. And I think that's about all I need to say. Namaste. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.